Welcome back once again everybody. Lore here with you. Alright, so it's time to do a Lionel only video. And this really is the easiest method. Kill him before he has a chance to hit back. Now viewers be aware there's going to be people commenting, Hey, there's an easier way. Do parries and do perfect dodges and mount him and hit him on the head. And you know what? That stuff is not the easiest way because you're in a fight. You got to kill him before you even get into the fight. Get him dead before he has a chance to hit back is truly the easiest. Now there's a method here I use, it's called launching off the horse. Jump and take the ball the second you do. Notice how Link keeps going upward. He's going up, 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 then he kind of tops off, he stays up there, then he starts coming back down. Alright folks, the reason I'm showing you that is because it takes a little bit of practice, but if you can get that down, you can usually kill these things before they even, you know, before you're even done in the air. And you're going to be up there so long, you'll probably have to eat some extra stamina. So make sure you have some stamina packed. More preparatory notes. Spin attack. As soon as that's done and you land, uh, get behind your Lionel. And if you're on his right side, eventually he's going to kind of come out of it and then like flip to the right to see what's going on. So anticipate that movement. He's, you know, stay behind him, spin around. If you're on his left side, he's going to flip to the left to see what's going on. So again, anticipate that. Stay behind him, keep swinging. What do I mean by swinging? Hold down that B button, keep that spin motion going. And you're really gonna kill him before he even has a chance to see what's even happening. So here's your Dragon Bone Moblin Club. I have a five shot burst Savage Lionel Bow or whatever your most powerful bow happens to be. If it's early game, you'll only be dealing with a red Lionel or something, so it'll work out just the same for you. Bone attack up, folks. Disguise Bone Attack Up, that's either the Radiant Set or your Ganon Phantom Armor. And that's going to be a 1.8 times the attack power of that weapon. Eat an attack power meal on top of that, like I have one going now. Your new multiplier is 2.7 times the attack power of that weapon. Very, very lethal, unstoppable force with that. You can do the same with Ancient Proficiency and Ancient Weaponry, but they break quick, so I don't recommend that. Alright, so without any further ado, here we go. Headshots, double damage. You want to do as much damage from the air as possible, folks. Now, if you've got a really weak bow, I'll just kind of back out now. You notice I could have stayed up there a lot longer, but I wanted to show you guys what I was talking about with spin attack. So stay behind him. Just keep spinning around. If you're dead behind him, he's going to go to do that, but he'll be dead before he can actually pull it off. So either way, just keep spinning. And if you're really that worried that it's taking too long, Depending on what Lionel you're dealing with, just go ahead and take that shield out at that point and block that fire blast or whatever. But again, get him dead before you can hit back. Truly is going to be your easiest method. Beginners especially appreciate that because they just can't pull off what other people are out there saying the best and the easiest. And of course, anytime somebody says best or easiest, it's always open to interpretation and personal opinion. However, comma... I'm just going off the feedback I've been getting. Alright folks, I'm going to do one more here. And again, I'm going to keep that Lionel bow out. In fact, I'll use a lower grade bow there just so you can see. It'll all work out just the same. Alright, let's do this thing. Take that bow out the second you jump off your horse. That really is key to getting the most time in the air. And I'll show you how to eat the extra stamina, which I'm sure you guys already know how to do that. So as you get real low there, don't let yourself actually run out. Just do whatever damage in the air you can. Now if I was, you know, not talking there and completely paying attention to my game, I could have actually killed him from the air, but that's okay. Stay behind him, do the damage. If your weapon breaks, your weapon breaks. Just take out a new one, do it all over again. Okay, I'm going to use my shield and block that, because obviously I didn't want to take a blast there. But as you can see, it doesn't take too much longer to get him dead. So that really is key, folks. Get him dead before he has a chance to hit back. Absolute, hands down, easiest way to kill a Lionel. I hope that helps. Best of luck to you guys out there, and happy hunting.